unearthing gold, silver, coins and relics. This is Historic Northumberland. Hi uh, guys, I am out and I am heading towards the stubble field. Cows or no cows. It's round two and I'm going to win this time. I uh, just dug this hole here. It's probably the best signal. I've found a couple of bits of foil. But this, I can just see the rim of it and it looks thin and it looks like a coin. Just there. Let's take it out. Yeah, it's no copper coin I think. A bit crusty. Doesn't look in good condition at all. Just give it a wipe. Yeah, it's very old and it's not round as you'd expect a copper coin to be round. Yeah, interesting. Always get interference with the garret. But the cows are behaving. I uh, just found this little buckle as well. Still got the clasp and a bit of leather attached to it still. I'm not sure how old that'll be. Well, this part of the field along the hedge, uh, it's all full of iron. Um, detectors going crazy, really jumping all over the place, so I'm trying to move away from there. Got a half decent signal and I've just turned it over. At first glances it looks like a hammy, but knowing me it'll be a bit of scrap. I'll show you what I mean. Just there, let's take him out. Oh, 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 hold on, just, ah. It's very heavy, feels like lead to be honest, not a hammy. Well you can see why I thought it was going to be a hammy and got quite excited. But it just looks like a really thin piece of lead. Ah, gutted. Ah well, it's really hard going in this field, it's very, in some parts, solid clay. Ah, uh, that has been shaped piece of lead that's been flattened and shaped. Interesting. Oh well, let's carry on. Well, I'm starting to move over towards the other side of the field where the bull is, which is quite scary. I dug that hole there and there's a huge musket ball, which tells me there's history, which is good because I haven't been finding anything. There we go, musket ball, let's carry on. So I've moved closer towards where the bull is. Uh, I found the musket ball and I have this. Not sure if it's a coin, but it's very, very thin. Uh, I think it might have been part of a brooch or a necklace. Hmm. I can just about. S oh, put it in shot, it'll help. Just about see some sort of detail on it. Hmm. Very, very thin. I don't think it's a Scottish coin. Haven't found any of them for a while. Um, I'll give it a clean and get back to you. Well, I think I found the hot spot that Cressy7 told me to look out for. It's not a very good hot spot at the moment, but I am finding more than I was on the other side of the field. Uh, looks like a coin, but it's a button. And anyone that watches my videos will know that I've probably found more buttons than Dorothy Perkins could ever hope for. Anyway, let's crack on, see what else is here. And on the surface of the hole I was trying to dig, it's another button. Surprise! Mmm, buttons. Mmm. I just dug that huge hole down there, it took me ages to find it, and I think it's a coin. I don't think it's got much detail on it. I think everything in this field comes out a bit minging. Yep, it was a coin at one point. No idea what it is now. I mean, still is a coin, but I don't know what it is. You know what I mean. Just dug that hole there, and I have a coin ball. Not far from where I found the other coin. I have found something. Hmm, doesn't look very coiny. 
Ah, a buckle maybe? Yep, I do believe it's a buckle. I like this part of the field. A lot more finds. The soil is really, really tough and clay. Ah, uh, yeah, you can see it's all bent and buckled. Excuse the pun. <laughs> oh well, let's carry on. I dug that hole there, and I'll give you a guess what I found. Begins with B, ends in N, has a U, a double T, and a freaking O in it. Yeah, it's a button. But it's not a bad button because when I turn it over, it's got quite a nice detail to it and a bit of gold gilding. So, as far as buttons go, that's not too bad. But it's still a button. Ah! I dug the huge hole over there, there's all the spoil, and it looks like a coin. It was a coin. Now it's just a, a blank copper disc. Like everything you find in here has been absolutely trashed. Apart from buttons. Ah oh well. Not sure if I get any detail of that. Ah oh well, let's carry on and see what else is here. I've moved up quite far from where I was. Power cables nearby causing me havoc. Well, I found a signal here, just see it. It is round. Uh, quite thick. Nope. And it's mangled as again every coin that seems to come out of this ground is just destroyed. Don't know why, it must just be that kind of soil. It's causing havoc with a metal detector, I know that much. But yeah, yeah. Unless I find silver, I don't think I'll gonna be able to tell you what dates these coins are. I haven't found this silver for quite some time to be honest. Oh well, let's carry on and see what else is here. Well guys, that's it for me. Uh, the rain started now, so I am off. Uh, just a quick roundup, not not a lot really, but I will come back. I was just trying to find the hot spots on the field really. There's a big musket ball. There's a bird ring. Nice piece of pottery. Uh, a big random piece of stuff. Buckle. Button. Button. A lead thing that I thought might have been a hammy. Uh, piece of iron. Big piece of lead. Random thing. A buckle the buckle. A piece of bullet. A random little piece of metal thing. Uh, a few coins and buttons. That's quite a nice button. That could be a love token, copper love token maybe, not sure. Big coin, which I'll probably never know what it, date it is, and these two are pretty similar. And a small one there. Ah, oh, there's a button. Surprise, surprise. Anyway, I will come back and see, uh, see what else is here. But the rain started now, so that's me heading off. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.